Well, hello and welcome back. In this video, we're going to learn how to find the folder that our camera uh, saved the pictures that we took uh, in uh, on your hard drive and then copy some of those pictures into a special folder we have on our desktop. So the first thing you want to do is to find the folder that uh, your camera saved the pictures that you took in. Uh, depending upon your camera's software, uh, will depend upon where that uh, is located. Uh, in my case with a Kodak camera it creates its own directory and then within that directory for Kodak there's a subfolder called DCIM and that's where it saves the pictures. So we're going to locate that folder, have that open, if it's open to the maximized condition, restore it and if it's too large, you can remember you can resize it. All right. And we're also going to change the view to thumbnails so we can actually see the pictures. And we have that folder open and we also see our special folder on our desktop that we're going to copy some files to. And we're going to copy the files, not drag and drop, although that's easy to do but I'll show you why we don't want to do that. We're going to highlight this file and drag it over. Notice it disappeared from the original directory. We just moved the original picture. Now if we uh, happen to delete this folder by accident we've lost that image forever. So I'm going to open that up. I'm going to move that image back in. You'll see I already have some pictures in that uh, screen folder. So we close that down. Now we all take a lot of pictures with our cameras, but not all of them come out great. So simply go through the folder uh, that your digital camera images are in and choose the ones that you like and would like to have for a screensaver. Highlight it and then come over to the left portion of that open uh, folder. Find the words copy this file and left click that'll open up a navigation screen simply grab the scroll bar go all the way down to the bottom to where your desktop folders are shown highlight the folder that you want to save those into in this case uh, we named a folder called screen as the one we're going to save them to click on that you'll see the icon for that folder is an open folder as compared to a closed folder for the rest of them and the word screen is highlighted this confirms that you have in fact selected that folder uh, to copy these things into. Then click on the word copy. Choose a few more uh, images, highlight, copy this file. Windows remembers where you copied something to the last time and still has that folder open so you don't have to open it every time. And copy. Highlight the image or the file. Copy this file. Copy. It's that easy. So after you've copied uh, 8 or 10 or 20, however many pictures you want for your slideshow into that folder, you can close your original uh, digital camera image folder open up the folder you've saved them to just to make sure the images that you want are in there and to make sure any images you don't want aren't in there. If they aren't you can simply delete them. Simply highlight it and hit the delete key on your keyboard and that will delete that image. It only deletes it from the screen folder not the original directory you still have your original picture. So we have all our pictures that we want for our slideshow in that folder. We can close that. So in this video we learned how to locate the folder that our digital camera software saved the pictures to and then copy some of the pictures from that folder into our special folder on the desktop that we created in preparation to make a screensaver that's a slideshow of the pictures that we took with our own camera. 
and we'll do that in the next video. We'll see you in the next video.